And they're off. They race over a mile and a half here for the Ribblesdale Stakes. Trefoil in the green with a white cap is slow to go. Barani Star in the white colours and Anastasia dropped out towards the rear of the field. As the first one to show is Golden Lips with the cheek pieces on. Shows in front. A red cap for Frankly Darling runs quite keen in the early stages. Colour change West End Girl. Light blue jacket there for Sheen Murphy holds the position against the running rail and showing in third. So I told you and Passioner together and then comes Miss Yoda. The maroon and blue colours caught out a little wide as they race downhill. Trefoil in the green who started a tad slowly has moved up to being halfway down down the field and Istimon on the nose banded runner hold fast the next couple and then Anastasia in green and red and she's on the outside of Barani star mainly white colors for Andre Zeni as they've completed the first third of the journey they're very well strung out it's uh, a good four to five length lead for golden lips and um, Josephine Gordon as they run round the turn towards the halfway stage they'll be about 12 lengths first to last frankly darling and Frankie to Tory sit in second position and then the light blue West End girl Miss Yoda and Rob Havlin the blue sleeve jacket moved up into a share of third position passion and so I told you the next pair as they approach the last half mile a length away to Trefoil and then in his Timon the orange cap behind those is hold fast nose bounded runner she's got two behind her by Rani Starr and Anastasia as they head then towards the home turn they have just over a half mile to go it's a reduced lead now for Golden Lips. She's only about two lengths ahead. Frankly, Darling in second place. There's about a length and a half to West End Girl and uh, on her outside, Miss Yoda. Passion in the dark blue colours. Making good progress. Has come through almost in fourth position now. In Istimon, and so I told you, the next pair and then Trefoil on the extreme right is labouring. They are down the straight and still Golden Lips has the advantage, but now, Frankly, Darling comes to join her and goes past her. Frankly, Darling has gone through the lead here to Golden Lips who's backing on well Miss Yoda in Istimon on the right the light blues coming with a late challenge Barani Star is running on as well but frankly darling she's clear three length advantage now inside the last furlong in Istimon in the light blue James Dole on the outside trying to chase her down but it's in vain frankly darling Frankie Dottori win in Istimon in second passion in third Barani Star was next Anastasia Miss Yoda and the pace setting Golden Lips in line behind those five six seven well, she is majestic. She stretched out majestically at Newcastle. She had to potentially work a little harder here, but she was still impressive, this Frankly Darling. She was, yeah. She looks the real deal, doesn't she? She had it to prove the style. There was style last time, the style and substance today. She beat two Aidan O'Brien well-bred fillies. And the race in the end, after maybe an anxious first furlong, panned out beautifully for Frankie, didn't it?